this thing on? Hello? Hello, McFly? It's the camera. They see us. Oh, I can't see them. Right. <laughs> but they can see us. Yeah. Okay, all right. So, all right, guys. Uh, we want to welcome y'all back to RV Living in the USA. We've been away for a couple months. Um, we, as many of you know, we have a Christmas tree farm. So we came home to run that, uh, take care of that, but we're officially closed for the season. So now we're back into RV mode. Uh, so we want to remind everybody to like and subscribe. Share this video with all your friends. We're going to have a lot of new, new content coming out this year. I think you're going to really like the new stuff we got for you. So, we, we last talked to y'all back at mid-October. Uh, we had a problem with one of our slides. Uh, stopped working altogether So uh, while we were in Pigeon Forge. So, we scheduled to have it fixed once we got home. Uh, once we got home, got it right into the shop. Um, apparently, the mechanism, the motors, everything went bad in it. It wasn't under warranty. Uh, they gave us a bill of about $4,000, which blew our socks off so we kind of we got we want to give a shout out to campers in of jacksonville north and lippert because they work together with us um we were able to get some good real credit and they cut the bill down over 60 percent so that was definitely a blessing in disguise oh, yeah. um, saved a bunch of money went ahead and had them put an inner rod in we got us some new water filters um, so that part's done uh, Yearly, you're supposed to get your roof inspected and make sure there is no issues. We won't have any, but we want to get inspected. So uh, we went ahead, a friend of ours referred us to a place located in Hoboken, Georgia, that does PVC roofs. Um, it's called Lee's Camper Repair. If you're in the area and need work done, we highly recommend great people to work with. They uh, washed the whole RV, uh, went through, uh, cleaned the roof, uh, put any, yeah, inspected it, put any, uh, more sealant upon places that were thin or needed sealant. Uh, they conditioned all of our slides, so everything's in great shape now. So we're completely ready to go camping. We got the truck, got an oil filter change done on it, and we got a fuel filter put in it. So we're good to go. Uh, we're going to head out to Flagler Beach here um, about the second week of December. Uh, we're going to spend a couple weeks down. We're going to come home for Christmas because we want to spend it with the family, um, see your grandkids. Uh, family is extremely important to us. Um, but then after that, um, after Christmas, we were thinking of... As soon as right after Christmas, we're going to go to Beach Mountain, oh, North Carolina, right. yep. with the kids. Yeah, we got a, Karen got us an Airbnb up there, so we're not taking the camper. Uh, we're going to enjoy a little bit of snow and Thank have some fun. Snow. Take the grandkids with us, so that's going to be really fun. Uh, we'll try to get you a video on that. Um, then when we get back, uh, we're going to head right out. We're going to bounce around Florida because we already have some prior engagements that we had made last year in Florida at the beginning of the year. So we're going to go to Tampa and Orlando and work away Fort Myers. Uh, we're going to spend a little time in the Keys. Um, Might be Everglades. Yep. Yeah, and then we'll work our way back up here for Easter weekend. Uh, spend Easter with the grandkids again. And... Then, then work our way up to up the North Carolina beaches, Virginia area, all the way up, and eventually end up in and the and the and the Rondacks, and up New York. New York, and then <laughs> we're gonna try to go into Canada. Hey. So hopefully that'll be fun. We'll show you what a border crossing is like if we make it. Hopefully we will. Um, but then we're going to uh, spend a little time, we're going to work our way over to Pennsylvania, see some family that Karen has over there, um, and then we'll work our way back south, and we plan on being back home here in Florida uh, about mid-October next year. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're going to have a lot of new content. Um, I asked Santa for some new equipment for Christmas. <laughs> uh, we're going to see if Santa comes through or not, um, but we think you're going to like some new content we're coming out with next year. So, like I said, share the video with your friend. Uh, we just hit over during the, uh, while we were here, we got over 100 subscribers. We want to keep that growing. Uh, we're on Facebook and Instagram as well under RV Living in the USA. So, go in there and like us and follow us there too. Uh, we have daily stuff we put on there. But uh, we look forward to uh, making some videos, leaving some comments. 
if you we're going to go to an area that you're going to be in, shoot us a message. We'd love to meet you, say hello. Uh, if you have some things we need to do in the area we're going to be that you think are really cool, you want us to check out for you, let us know that as well. You know, we're here for y'all. Um, we're going to get some new content. Hopefully, y'all enjoy it. Um, Till the next time, we'll catch you on the flip flop. flop.